What is up guys? Angel back again. So our weekend is complete and we're back home. Um, had, had some fun mon uh, this weekend. Going to uh, the theme park, Bush Gardens. I recorded everything on a crappy camera. This is the camera right here. It's probably better um, for blogging. Not so much action cam. Um, maybe with a tripod and really good lighting. Um, and no movement at all. You know. It'd probably be a decent blog camera. You know, for starters. But, definitely not as good. Maybe it would have been a little better with a tripod. Some kind of stabilizing mount. But, I don't know. I mean, it looks kind of cool. It's got an icon quality. The thing is, it's 10 years old. It's outdated. So, if I were to wreck, sorry for dirty finger, I was working today. So, um, we're done working today. So, now I wanted to do some blogging. So, anyways, this is an icon cool picks 10 megapixels, uh, one frame per second. It's got auto stabilize. It's a 3.5 uh, lighting adjustment, which is not bad. It could be a 2.8 or a 2.0. Um, this was this shit back in the day. Um, still in pretty good condition. It's just been sitting in my drawer. Pretty shiny. Some fingerprints. You know, simple off and on power button. Um, it's got half a button and then the full, if you press down fully or halfway, um, halfway is like a shutter with the, fil with the flash and then all the way down is, um, you take the actual picture. Now on the bottom it gives you some specs. There's a little hole here. I don't know if it'll focus that or not, but there's threads in there also. That's where... The tripod tripod can screw into looks like we got an HDMI port or something here I don't know what that is might be HDMI and then this is where the battery comes out SD card and battery um, SD card goes right behind the battery pretty easy it's got this little orange lock right here pretty easy to use very reliable um, most cameras, this thing, this flap breaks and the battery goes flying. Uh, it hasn't broken on me yet. I mean, I've, I've been, I've had it in my pocket. Um, getting in and out of rides and the car, took it to work. I mean, it's, it's a pretty good, um, camera. Let's see if I can get this battery in there the right way. Of course, I had it backwards. So, the battery goes in there like that. And then the SD card behind it, but I'm not going to put that in there. And turn the on button. And it is on. I did record a lot this weekend, and my SD card has a little bit more memory, but that's how I turn it on and off. And I'll show you the front once I power it on. Sometimes there's a little light here that blinks. Look at that. That's where all the magic happens in those lens. I'll zoom it in. Got five times the zoom. And once you turn it off, the lens closes and collapses. Not bad. I think this thing is going on eBay for anywhere from like 80 to 120. Um, not sure about now. This is the charger though. Very cool charger, um, low profile, almost the size of the camera, it's a comparison right there, but yeah, almost, but uh, it's cool, put the battery charge and just push it out of the way, you can see that orange light, it'll blink when it's charging, when it's done charging, it'll stay steady, so anyways, oh, what is that? I've got some exciting news for today. We can go ahead and 
we've got the picture that we wanted from this camera now we're gonna have to uh, uh, wait for the other camera now I did get something in the mail that's what this package is right here we don't know what it is so we're gonna open it so let me, I'm gonna use two hands I'm gonna pause it and then I'm gonna show you after I open it. all right here we go okay so oh, I'm not supposed to see that but there it is oh man today is an exciting day oh my goodness I've been waiting for this I don't know for how long but it's got to be like four or five days maybe a week now look at it it's freaking here the reason I got this one because it was like a GoPro same size it was not the GoPro price though it is 4k ultra HD DV whatever 30 30 meters submersible underwater it's got the water case now it says 4k 30 frames per second but honestly I've seen and heard so many reviews about use, just using the 1080p 60 frames per second that it's way better than this 4k maybe who knows maybe in the future a couple of years or next year this so I don't know what happened there but looks like I gotta get some videos off of my camera but anyways hopefully next year that 4k will be a lot better and we'll order the newer one 16 megapixels um, so it's gonna be better than the old camera we already know off bat 60 frame per second at 1080p way more better than that one frame per second uh, Nikon even though Nikon is brand name you know but I, I'm guessing back in the day it was pretty good um, connect through Wi-Fi 170 degree angle now if this thing has really good wide lenses I'm gonna be happy super happy very similar to the go pro but it's not it's made in China so let's open this bad boy up hopefully my phone doesn't um, see I'm gonna need two hands again but anyways I'm gonna try my best here this one's a little easier didn't have to rip it open The unboxing is finally here. We've got, man, this thing looks pretty nice. Looks very nice. Hold on one second. I'm going to take everything out and then I'll show you guys. Okay, okay. So we got everything out, laid out on the table here. We've got a clip. Look at that focus. We've got the charger, one part of the charger. We've got another piece of this, um, I'm guessing this goes on the back. Yeah, just in case this one breaks, we've got a spare. See, that's awesome. We've got the camera, which is probably the most important part. We've got so many clips. This one looks like it's mounted. And this one is a clip. Probably for the shirt. Excuse me. And we have a screw in here. Oh, that thing has a screw in. Well, what do you know? There's a little flap here, and maybe it'll screw in there. Who knows? So, and then, oh, look. It's for the selfie stick, I'm getting. And if it's not for the selfie stick, then it's probably for something else. We have another clip here. We got so many clips. And then probably uh, two adhesive mounts. You got the other part of the charger. Another mount here, for, probably for a bicycle, motorcycle, handlebar. And then that's probably another selfie stick mount. What's here? Velcro. A wipe for the lens, I'm guessing. And some adhesive. Zip ties. Which, what am I going to zip tie this thing to? Really? And that's it. Can't wait to use it. I'm going to put it on the charger and then uh, 
we're gonna start using it probably tomorrow I'm gonna make sure it's fully charged and it's probably a charge right now but I've got some cleaning I gotta do I just got home went to work this morning all day had two three air conditioning calls after work because I do own my own air conditioning company uh, but anyways so excited yeah 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 so uh, next thing to do is get some tripods in here so we can have some more steady shots and not this shaky hand movement stuff all right youtubers like follow subscribe and um, sorry I didn't put too much video today kind of a short video today but I uh, appreciate you guys following this is where I do my editing at nothing special little Toshiba gets the job done all right guys make sure you hit that like button peace out